Um, you want to try doing my uh, my trick? Casey will try. What Casey do you want to do? This is what happens when you don't catch fish for 24 hours. Casey's trying to act cool now because the camera's on. I don't think I'll do that later tomorrow. <laughs> <laughs> What's going on guys and welcome back to another episode of McGrath Fishing. We are down here in Del Rey today. We're going to be targeting some peacock bass and maybe a bonus snakehead. But the target species today is going to be peacock bass. We would not be down here if it wasn't for Follow the Action Outdoors. They're an outdoor apparel company that covers you from fishing to hunting. They got the most awesome, badass, hand-drawn, custom designs for the everyday outdoorsman. If you guys do want to get anything, be sure to use promo code McGrathFish to save 20% off on your entire order. Also, if you're on FollowTheAction.com, you can click the McGrath Fishing tab. If you want to get any of my merch, support me. I think the designs are pretty sweet. I will pop up a few right here, but check them out. And the only thing you cannot use my code for is my stuff. But all right, we are going to be at the spot in about five minutes. We're going to start fishing. Hopefully, we land some peas today. Um, I've never caught one, so I really want to knock this off my bucket list and catch some biggins today and get some sweet pics, some sweet video. I will right, we'll see you guys when we get there. Palm Beach in Southern Florida. With its inlets and launches, it is known for a multitude of species. Snapper, tarpon, marlin, and snook, to name but a few. But amidst the calm Florida breeze and warm sun, lurks the ultimate expeditionist. The infamous Tommy McGrath. On this trip, however, Tommy will target the formidable predators of the North Atlantic Ocean bull sharks, stingrays, and the enormous goliath groper, as well as black tip sharks that arrive in the shallow waters of Palm Beach in their thousands from January to March. There will be many obstacles that will have to be overcome throughout these adventures, but with the help of his companions Justin and Casey, Tommy is confident of success. They'll need to work together in order to be efficient. Combining their many years of fishing experience and knowledge gained on countless voyages, if they are to have any chance of overcoming the beasts that lurk in these waters. What up? How you doing? Pretty good, man. Oh, so okay. nice to meet you. Hey, you got that FTA on now. Hell yeah. FTA. Always got a rep. Oh, I got a peacock, the first ever. It ain't that big. Dude, no way. I'm on. I'll a nice one. Oh, dude, they're all nice, man. No way. Yo, My first ever peacock. Yo, this is a male, right? Yeah, dude, that is sick shit, man. Yeah, this bait's in. What are we, triple up, quadruple up? Triple up, look at this. On that one. That's a male right there. Wait, hold there. on, hold it just like that. Oh, that's sick. I can't believe you're fishing with a float. Justin, talk to me, bud. They're dropping it, too. Oh, I caught a cichlid. I'm gonna get that pee, though. Big one. Oh my god, it just broke my hook. Huge pee, take this shit. Are you serious? Giant pee. Why did it easy, bro? Super easy. Oh, dude, I'm used to smallmouth. I know how these, all this shit oh, works. Oh, yeah, dude, you got the technique. There you go. That's a big pee right there. Spence, here's the goat, dude. Look at that thing. Look at the lump on him. You got him? <laughs> no way. That's your hook right there. Look at that. He just broke guys, him off. Guys, I just caught the one that broke me off. All right, guys, my second pee. So look at that. Nice hump on his head. This is my second pee got ever. My first one's a little bit small, but we're going to snap a few pics of this one. But look, at that, look at that pattern, guys. That is a beautiful fish right there. Great job. Absolutely beautiful. All right, we're going to get a pick, get this fish back, keep it nice, healthy. Catch a release, baby. Here we go. All right, guys, we're putting it back. Here you go. It's just small too. That's gotta be a sick lid. Oh, is that a peacock? Yeah. 
Oh, yeah. Dude, these things fight actually pretty hard. They're like bluegill on steroids. Yeah, it's like this. Come on. They got beat. Can I get a f***ing shot of it? I haven't even gotten one yet. Seriously? <laughs> Hooked up. <laughs> Dude, this thing is fighting so hard. Another peacock, guys. That's my third. The lows are nasty. I just got. Oh my god! We got him! We got him! That's a monster! Oh my god! That one's ten pounds. I'm hooked up on a giant, guys. Wait, we need that scale on that camera bag. Scale on camera bag. Yeah. Guys, we're hooked up on a giant. It's an absolute giant. It's a giant. It's a giant. Get a bed. Casey, you should. Grab that camera for me, bud, on this one. Oh, dude, that's a really nice one. Are you gonna land him? Oh, look at that, darn. Oh, it might be on the cooler. It's on the left of the cooler. Nice, dude. This is a super nice one, guys. Look at this thing, it's literally just rip and drag. It's going out deep too, it's going out deep. Yo, that's a 10 pounder all day, look at that thing. That's a real one. Bring him right to me. Look at that thing. Casey, watch your head. Holy cow, that one's a It's a giant, it's a giant. Very nice. Get your rod out of your No way! Yo! Big Yo! Cow, baby. Dude, look that is that a thing. giant! Oh! Look at that monster! Oh, guys, look at this. That's Absolute right giant! Alright guys, I landed another giant. I'd guess this one about 5-6 pounds. Gonna get a quick weight on this one. Look at these beautiful colors though. You can tell it's a male by this little hump on his head. This is my biggest peacock ever and my fourth ever peacock. Absolute giant. It is 5 pounds. 5, 5 and a quarter. We're gonna snap a few pictures and get a safe release on this guy. Here we go. All right guys, so we got kicked out of the spot. We gotta leave. Just landed that five pounder. Absolutely unbelievable. My fourth ever peacock. Feeling great. The bite is pretty good today, despite being windy and the cold front coming through. So hopefully this bite continues and we can put together even something more insane than this. But so far, so good. All right guys, spot number two. Uh, we got kicked out of the last one only because it was like a hospital. So now we're gonna go fish this apparently natural lake, hopefully for some snakehead and peacock again. But I left the camera in the car and we got the crew. Said I love what you're doing. Largy? Largy! There it is, another fish. Guys, I just was taking a piss, gave literally just my right rod, and look what me. happened. Literally right when you told me to set the hammer to it. Nice. nice. I was reeling in my shiner like this, and I had a probably a four pound, five pound peacock come up in the surface and smack my shiner. Oh, I just got oh, smacked. You just got nailed. I just got nailed. Set it, set it, set it, set it. Yeah, 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 you're on. Oh, yeah. Oh, my God. Oh, yeah. <laughs> oh that's the same one. That's the same one. Oh, that one just There's two. <laughs> Watch your guys' lines. Right These things fight so hard. This is. Holy crap, that thing's so mad. Well. Yeah, this is up. Oh, look at him. Look oh, at him. Look at his head. head. Oh, dude. Oh, Justin, watch your line. 
Look at the colors on these pretty as shit. Beautiful picture worthy. Look at that colors. Oh, you see the blue on him? Oh, my God. oh man. Yo, look how pretty that fish is right look there. Look at that, guys. I'd say that's probably what? Two, three pounds? That's a four pounder, three nah, pounder. That's, like three. that's a three. I'd say yeah. three. One last look on the GoPro. Beautiful colors. I got a spot in the tail. Oh, check that out. All right, here we go. We got a female and a male on that bed. About to breed, probably. Look at how colorful they are. So, guys, remember, this is the male with the hump. That's got no hump. Female That's a female. With no hump. Look at beautiful. beautiful oh, let's, get, let's get a sweet release right here. Just like this. Swims right off. Guys, I missed the hook set, but it was literally just ripping. My my bail was open. I just felt it peeling off. So, but I got it on now. Spencer's about to land it. He's got the FTA hat and hog hunter on. Look at that. <laughs> That's, that's that's probably a three and a half right four there. pounder yeah that's probably three wait hold it just like that guys look at this look at this fish beautiful another male another four pounder in the books look at this guy right back in this is awesome guys look look what casey just pulled out of the water with his bare hands but yet you're afraid to grab a bowfin that thing smells like shit watch out big jay's here big jay's here Guys, it's pretty cool going back to my roots. Right when I walked out here, I looked at Justin, my dude, like, this is totally my element. All right, guys, we're gonna head to the bait shop, go get some more shiners, and actually head back to that medical center, hope for the best. But we just slammed a bunch of peacocks there. As you guys saw, we probably have 30 plus so far for the day. So we're gonna go get some more shiners and then head back to that spot and hopefully some more giants. But it's already been unreal, knocking off a bucket list catch for me, another species for me. And yeah, so uh, I will see you guys at the bait shop. All right, guys, we are back at this medical center. Uh, I'm gonna leave the camera in the car so it's easier to walk around with just my backpack. We got 10 dozen shiners. So we're gonna head back and hopefully slap a bunch more peas. Here we go. Monster, monster, monster. Guys, he's already hooked up as his first cast. Oh, I just got hit. Oh, I'm on, I'm on, I'm on. I'm on. <laughs> it's a giant. It's a giant. <laughs> oh, there's another one right behind it. Right, right behind mine. There's another one, boys. Hold that up. Dude, that's, that's probably a that's gotta be an eight. Yo, right Justin, there. give me some sick figures. Yo. That's oh huge, dude. That's the biggest one I've ever seen right there. That's it. That's it, dude. Here's the That's it, dude. That's a world record pee right there. Six pounds, 15 ounces. Look at that. Belly on that thing. Huge. Huge peacock. What? We haven't even gotten to the rocks yet. This isn't our primary spot. All right, guys. So the biggest of the day so far is a five pounder and now a 6.9 so six pounds 15 ounces i think looked way bigger than six You're that looked like 10 dude oh, what's up Casey? slapping them decent probably another two three pounder beat down meat down crack down smack down another one probably about a two two and a halfer going back in Guys, Justin got his first male. This is what he wanted. Justin really wanted one of those ones with the hump on it. Nice male, bud. Here. That's another four pounder. Oh! He just ate yours. Oh! Stop! Oh. Oh. That was insane. That was insane. Because he has a bass and a peacock was just sitting by it and it literally just smoked it on top of the water. There's another one. There's another one. Cast right behind me. Cast right behind me. That's a good one too. Oh my god, I just stepped in a snake hole. Guys, this is literally probably my my 15th of the day. No, no joke. Beautiful male. Beautiful colors. That orange is so badass too. What a beautiful fish. Love it. Love to see it.
<laughs> if you guys want to go check out Casey's six pound, 15 ounce peacock, head over to his channel, CZ Fishing. The link will be in the description below. All right, guys, we're on the other side of this pond now, or small lake, whatever you want to call it, most, pretty much a pond. Uh, had the GoPro off, but we are hooked up. Another P. Yeah, it's a P. That's a P. Oh, there's one right behind him. I got my line on top of it. Yo, there's, there's one right next to it. It's good. Why is my drag so loose? Check it out, guys. Another P. Nice male. Super bright. Dark colors, too, on top. Beautiful, beautiful P. Peacock, peacock, peacock. Looks like FTA is going to have to make a peacock shirt. That would be a sweet one. I better see you wear that then all the time. Oh, dude, I will. Every picture. Yeah. Small P. Right when the small ones start coming out, I think it's time to move down. Another one, a little tiny. Oh. Guys, check that out. Yeah, that's why I kill him. I'm going to have to start going to that. My thumb is shredded. All right, guys. Casey's over there. Justin's right here. I'm kind of just chilling in this pipe. Mike's right there and Spencer's over there. We're fishing this canal now for these peacocks. There's tilapia in here and also snake heads. I gotta keep... Oh! oh! That's big. Dude, he killed my baby on impact. I think he got... As I was doing that, guys. They're gonna just swing them up. Yeah, yeah. My first canal peacock. Beautiful pea, and then Justin has one right over there. Here's the canal. I'm chilling, fishing. All right, guys, these are our last shiners of the day. 70 plus, we're gonna see if we can finish strong. Gar, I got gar, the gar. Gar. Oh, gar. Kept it on too. Oh, no way to end the day, this is my last shiner. All right, guys, my first ever gar and my last fish of this peacock mission going back in. Well, guys, we are back done uh we ended probably about four four o'clock i think we made an hour drive back we got some food as well and now we just kind of been chilling in the hotel the winds are literally blowing like 2022 20, we have no visibility at the boat ramp spot it's gonna be super hard so i'm not really sure if we're gonna hit it tonight or not but today was honestly unreal a peacock bass has been on my bucket list for forever and to pretty much do it like this catch my first one ever catch a giant a five pounder i slept 30 myself today i think we got like a total of like 70 to 80 total in four hours of fishing, which is absolutely insane. Me, Justin, and Casey have never caught one, and just to kind of do it like this was pretty cool. So big shout out to Spencer. I'll leave his at to his Instagram right here and also down in the description below. He's a cool kid. He was the first mate on the charter boat, and we kind of talked about spots and stuff that we could fish, so we met up with him. But again, I don't know, to get a big one, to catch 30 myself, and just I kind of felt like I was in my element, just like bass fishing. I kind of knew what to do, how to do it really, and just like once I got like my feet with with the first one and kind of just roll from there and it was really cool to uh, just experience so i hope you guys enjoyed this banger of an episode is absolutely unreal just to film to see to see all the giants caught if you guys want to go see casey's six pound 15 ounce one go over to his channel cz fishing will also be linked in the description below it's absolutely giant so i left it out of my video because there were so many catches so bang your day you guys heard it all right i hope you guys enjoyed please remember to leave a like hit the subscribe button two videos every single week tuesdays and fridays at five o'clock p.m and also go to followtheaction.com slash mcgrath fishing to get my merch it is live on the site right now my code is not active for that unfortunately but i appreciate you guys support me and check some stuff out you guys might like it Another small little cock. Early mornings, late night cruising. Up and down the crystal cove and through the uneasy stream. Bass fishing, Corona drinking. We're just out here catching the American dream. Lay back, 
relax. Me grab fishing is all you need. 